and welcome back folks welcome back to let's play fallout we were back again at this place in time not in time but at least well in in-game time so last time we died at the very end of the video and then yeah we and it didn't save in between so we are back here that means that we will quickly uh, grab all the items that we grabbed last time. I think there was only 48 bottle caps from someone. Okay, someone there. He had the bottle caps. Can leave now. Um, yeah, let's can let's do this quicker. So last time we were killed by the rough guards, which were provoked. Um, not by our guns apparently, but it seems that if you're just too close to the entrance, they will attack you nonetheless. So from now on, I will just go around the building and completely avoid the entrance. Let us talk again, again to Erwin and tell him that we have that we've dealt with his little problem. Get the awesome gun, which is a rifle. Cut down to a firearm and 500 points in experience. Let us talk to Ian. Okay, Ian, have this gun, which is completely cluttering up my inventory. Okay, let's have this. We'll actually only have this. Um, and maybe. Wait. Oh, I didn't grab the stim packs, did I? I guess then it's time to reload. I'm very sorry, but I mean it's two stim packs. They are so they are very expensive. So I hope you don't mind if I. Okay, let's grab the bottle caps and then leave for the third time now. And then I will make a save, I promise. I will make a save, right right after the screen. <sighs> okay. okay, let us talk again to Erwin. Same dialogue, same reward. And let's talk to Ian. Give him the um, the pistol. Give him two stim packs. And then tell him to draw his best weapon. Let's see whether that new pistol is actually better. Or at least for him better. Uh, yeah. Come. What are weapons are you? Okay. Um, combat tactics. Draw your best weapon. Did he change? I'm not sure, actually. But I think he did. He, I think he changed his, blah, changed his weapon. And the weapon used 2.223 point, point ammunition. Okay, what is. What kind of ammunition is that, actually? I've... Ah, that's this one. Okay, then... Um, also have this ammunition, then. If you're carrying this gun. Okay. That's cutting up my inventory, also. That's a good trade, I'm sure. Okay. Let us now go to the... Um, the guy who I think deals in energy weapons was in Old Town. And just before we enter Old Town, I will make another save because I <laughs> I have the feeling this might not blah, might not be able to avoid the um, rough guards. So just to be on the safe side. Okay. 
Yeah, by the way, you may have noticed something about my voice. Um, it's a bit croaky, because I'm... I've been somewhat under the weather. But that's actually not the reason why there have been... Um, no videos over the last few days. That was actually a completely different reason. Um, and that different reason is Super Mario Maker, actually. Which I got on the day it was released. Um, it is a super addictive. I've spent like maybe eight hours editing levels straight without even Without even drinking, eating, or even knowing that, being aware that so much time has passed. This is really the most addictive game I've ever played, I think. Even more addictive than Minecraft. There's a skag. And she's not very happy that we're in her private room, so let's close the door and pretend that um, this never happened. Yeah, if you do own a Wii U, you probably already either have bought um, this game or about are thinking about. Okay, let us let us deal with this game, which is the game at hand. Let us see whether this man sells some good weapons. I don't actually think this is the guy that I'm um, that I wanted to see, but anyway. He's someone new. So I will read the dialogue to you. Hi. Welcome to Jake's. I've got some great merchandise in stock. Feel free to look around. What are you selling here? I deal with high-end arms. The best stuff you can find this side of the Brotherhood. And since the Brotherhood doesn't deal with outsiders, I've gotta say I'm the best. I have a sniper rifle, and you would be hard-pressed to find flamethrower fuel anywhere else in the wastes. I actually do have some flamethrower fuel, by the way, okay. Oh yeah, I've got a Geiger count to shoot, very rare. Can okay, you tell me about the sniper rifle? Tell me about the sniper rifle. Ah, the DKS is a fine long range weapon. It was originally a .308, but we rechambered it for the more common 2 to 3 round. We tuned the barrel too. Most importantly, check out this trigger. Smooth, eh? The trigger breaks perfectly... What? Oh. The trigger breaks perfectly now. Of all, this is a good choice for hunting any type of animal. Sorry, I didn't read this out correctly. Of all, this is a good choice... Blah. Of all, this is a good choice for hunting any type of animal. Hmm. I'm actually more interested in energy weapons, so let um, let me see what you want for the Geiger counter. What do you need the Geiger counter for? <laughs> Though it's been 80 years or so since the bombs fell, there's still radiation around, you goof. You can't see it, never could, but it's here. Sorry, it's there. Heck, I'm willing to bet you've got some counts on you, on you now. Everyone that lives in the waste has a few red cards. Hmm. Tell me more about radiation. Hmm. Now tell me how the, the Geiger counter actually works. It's pretty simple actually. You use it and it tells you how many reds you have. As long as you keep your red count under 100, you should be fine. Go above 100 and you're in some trouble. The worst part is you. You won't even know you've been sucking up rats until a few days later. Get over 1000 and you're cooked. Until, unless you get a hold of a whole lot of rat away. What can, I, what can you tell me about radiation? Well, some call it the phantom death. Cause that's what it is. You can't see it. You can't hear it. You can't even smell it. It's basically... It basically builds up in your system. You never feel it until it's too late. The more trips you make to hotspots, the more it builds up and they will never leave your system. Ever. The rats just keep, bu just keep building up. Well, 
Unless you can get a hold of some red away. Um, where can I, fi can I find red away? I haven't been, I haven't seen it being sold in many places. Or we could also, we could try to flatten him. Let's actually see what he responds to this. Okay. Wow, you know a lot. It sounds like you've been around. Well, I've been around. It used to be here with the Union of Atomic Workers. Sort of like the Brotherhood, but less friendly. They wanted to keep to themselves and I, well, I wanted to see the world and be my own boss, so I left. The, mut the, the mutants wiped them out about 10 years ago, so I guess I made the right decision. I eventually settled down there, sorry, settled down here. The cops don't like my trade and I've been roused more than once, but I'm a hell of a lot, but I'm a hell of a Hell of a lot more honest than most of the merchants here. By any chance, do you know something about a water chip? Man, you do like the rare stuff. Where were you when I was selling some depleted uranium ones a few years back? I don't do chips though, ain't a market in it. Anything else? Um, show me what you got. He has um, a combat shotgun. I think these, these are actually fairly good. He has magnums um, or magnums. <laughs> Apparently he sells rockets and energy cells. Hello. Um, and sniper rifles. I know I said in the beginning that I wanted to play a martial arts sniper character, but I Wait, is this a laser sniper rifle? Can I read the description, please? No, it's just a regular one. There's also, I think, a laser sniper rifle. Um, yeah, but when I said I wanted to play a sniper martial arts character, I actually meant, meant energy weapons martial arts character. Hmm. It sells combat armor. Um, I'm not sure it's actually worth it because the best armor in this game is the power armor. Um, which you can get at the Brotherhood of Steel. There are some grenades, but only MP grenades, okay. Hmm. What's that? A flamethrower? I've never actually used one of those here in this game. And I don't think I'm going to. Um, how much do you want for? <laughs> Five. You're out of your mind. Okay. Um, but you could buy maybe the shotgun. <laughs> Six. Okay. When you said. Didn't you just say something about having reasonable prices? I think you are. Dreamy. Okay, how much do you want for a sniper rifle? Okay, 12,000 is not so bad, I guess. Um, hmm. These weapons are all very, very expensive, so. Well, at least I could have your money. Give me all your money. I want all of it. Okay, have this useless. He actually gives me 250 bottle caps for this crap. I can't believe it. You can also have my uh, stupid combat knife that I will never. Did I actually give Ian a combat knife? Okay, let's hold on to this. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I think the combat shot. Did I just drop? The shotgun. Wait. Yep. I think the combat shotgun, shotgun is actually much better. Um, I won't use the magnum. Probably. You can, ha you can have all my iguanas. Uh, or maybe not, actually, because I don't think I don't think they weigh very much. Okay, we certainly don't need this pistol. 
Uh, that was the laser pistol. We'll hold on to this weapon. Uh, we'll we'll actually bring back the urn. We, we do. We will bring back the urn. Okay, maybe. Can I have back my? Okay, then uh, I will subs subtract. Um, Three hundred eighty. Okay. Oh, I can't calculate. Uh, sorry. Oh, I missed it. I missed a digit there. Okay. Never mind. Okay, that's a good trade. Now we can carry slightly more stuff. Um. Where's our carrying capacity? 170. Okay, we're still pretty much packed like a mule. Um, but this sorting out the inventory shall have to wait until the next video, actually. And then I think we shall go um, to Necropolis, but not directly, because I think. Um, depending on the map, let's see you actually where Necrop... I mean the world map. Oh, we can't see the world map here. Okay, anyway. So we, we shall make ourselves on the way towards Necropolis. But probably stop... Stop at Junktown and um, Shady Sands before that. Because there were some quests that were still open. Some easy quests, um, like this one, stopping the threat of the red scorpions and the junk town yeah there was I was told by one of my viewers that you can get someone as a follower there Tishi so we'll try to do that um, next time so until then until then folks folks sorry folks until then folks until then